I like I can dance because I like to dance with my friend and I mean. I can dance, I feel great, powerful and excited. My motivation for starting I Can Dance was an absolute belief that every child and young person who has additional needs needed to be seen and celebrated and to find the a medium that was creative, non-threatening as well as fulfilling for both them, their families and the local community to, to sort of really celebrate them. We integrate an approach from both dance movement psychotherapy, dance, just creative expressive dance, as well as using specific educational techniques. And I believe that an integrated approach really enables the young person to access the creative process. And then by truly accessing their creative process, they are then truly able to find a, a forum to express themselves. The way we work at I Can Dance is a cycle. It's about looking and reflecting and thinking and moving and shaping and then stopping, looking again from a different angle. Did we get it right this time? Did it work? Did it not? We're constantly thinking about what the child needs, not yesterday, not the day before, not in six months time, but right now. Where are they now? What are they telling me now? And how do I respond to that? I would say Hershey has very much grown up with I Can Dance and uh, it's been a big part of her life, uh, you know, almost throughout. And it's given her a chance and us a chance to actually s sort of do fun things but feel included in doing it and also stretch, uh, stretch ourselves and for Hershey to sort of, you know, experience new things. The very first day Egosa came in, she's been coming here now for over five years. I, um, I absolutely knew that this was the right place for her. The, uh, the group, the teamwork, the individual structure to what she actually needed, everything was just incorporated into that one hour section. I saw this pathway in my, in my daughter's eyes that just made me to believe that this is Egosa's. Ruby joined about three years ago and it's become one of our highlights and therefore it's one of our highlights. Ruby's uh, experience that she takes away is pleasure, it's joy, it's learning. There's, there's skills that she's learnt, turn taking, um, being able to listen to other people, being able to wait, um, being able to laugh with your peers, that's what she takes away. I really, really enjoy it, it would make sense to me. I will gonna come again, it will come to I Can Dance. Every, every now and then, every single year. When I can dance, I feel good. I Can Dance makes me feel happy. I feel very, very happy. We often work one-to-one. -one. Um, all of the interactions between the staff and the children are bespoke, tailor-made, and it will entirely depend on the needs of the child and what we believe will benefit them most. So if somebody is in a wheelchair, for example, then we may use a lot of touch to enable the body to move in ways that it may not otherwise get the opportunity to do. Um, and then for other children who perhaps like the connection of touch, but are getting to a stage where autonomy is something that is becoming a bigger part of their lives, then um, yeah, we, we try and step away from that and move into other ways of working and encouraging from a distance. I think the annual performance brings up so much thrill, just the adventure of being on stage and just having all those lights and just that space to be able to perform as they like. And I think that's what is so beautiful and so special then about that chance of having that annual performance because it gives us something to work for and work towards. 
So the annual performance is the crown of our year, where anyone and everyone in the community can come and be, be part of it with them. Enables them to feel that they are part of this wider community and that they are not alone and that they are not isolated. But that we're there, we see them, we're trying to understand them and work with them as best possible and that we really believe in what they offer society. I think for me that's the most important about the show is I don't want people to come because they say, oh, that'll be nice. But that they come and they say, wow, they look at what they give society and not what they've taken.